Got him that time. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm pegged up. Welcome back to the channel, everybody, and welcome on back to Texas for me. This is my first time going bass fishing today in the great state of Texas, back from Canada. Wow, it is a steamer out here. It is a Texas steamer. You know, there's really two things you can do in the summertime in Texas when you're going bass fishing. You can go out deep, you can fish deep grass lines, you can go brush piles and get way off of points, you can do all that, or you can target those shallow fish. Well, I just happen to be on a grassy lake right now. Got my boy Jerry from Guggen Squad. He's, uh, you know, he's one of our adventurous camera detail, and uh, he's got a pole with him today. We just wrapped up doing some, some squad filming, and now we're going to do some LFG filming. And what I want to do is get these frogs. I want to get these filthy frogs into these pads, into these grasses, get them deep in there, and get some blow ups. All right, I know you're about it. Come on, so smash that like button. Let's get to fishing. All right, I want to see if I got my, ooh, I got my little special buddy in here. Guys, I've been waiting until frog season to throw this. Old Extreme, Extreme Angling, gave me this too. He had it a uh, custom done. Not even sure of the procedure to do it, but that is a pink frog. And <laughs> wouldn't that be cool to catch one on a pink frog? Yes. And in cer certain situations, I'm sure it's preferred. I don't know about out here, but we'll see. So I got popping, popping style here. May revert back to the uh, the old original if the popping pink doesn't work out. But I'm probably gonna fish this thing until I get a good one on it. I just want to say, caught a bass on a pink frog. Gonna go with the old trusty Palomar knot. Pretty much only tie a palomar on on uh, the frogs. That's about it. Oh yeah. This is a situation where I should probably take off the Doppler, but I've I've left it left it on here today because I've been lazy and still haven't ordered my other transducer mount. But it's doing all right. This grass, super thick stuff, guys. So what we encountered, we were filming. Some uh, some top water stuff out here. By the way, this is a new bait. Some people have been asking about this. I've showed it in a couple of my videos. This is the two step. Should be out in the next month or so. So you know, summer top water walking bait. Good stuff. Caught fish on it this morning. Out in the little holes in the grass, but we have not ventured into the thick stuff where I think a lot of these fish are probably gonna be pulled up. I mean, this this is almost surfaced out hydrilla and mill foil and everything. So frog is gonna be our friend here. You going popping frog, Jer? I got a popping frog. I, I do too. Popping frog too. Oh, I'm popping and walking, baby. Look at that thing, golly. So I think they're either gonna be out in the holes in the middle of the lake or they're gonna be up in the sticks eating frogs, snakes, squirrels, bluegill. Check my drag, make sure I'm locked down. I'm locked. We'll, we'll definitely put the old uh, green series to the test here today. Oh my gosh, Jerry, oh right my. off the bat. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was a little one, but that was a ferocious bite. What, what color are you throwing? I got a little bluegill. Bluegill color? Yep. Oh, yeah. A little bluegill? I don't like it. Pink bubble gum. Bubble gummers. Eating those uh, big league chews that fall from the trees. Are you serious? 
Dude, it was dangling over a limb. <laughs> Is that what we're dealing with? First bite on the pink frog. I wasn't even prepared for that. He had it too. It's gonna get wild. It's gonna get pretty western. Come on. Jerry's getting tossed around right now. This is so loud. Did you see that? I'm about to reel that sucker in. There you go. Pink frog in it, baby. I was about to reel it in and I basically hooked the fish. He was just following it. Oh, he took it deep too. That's what I like to see. First bass landed on old Pinky there. That's a fun bite, fun bite. I was I was about to reel in and make another cast and it just whoosh, followed it up, came and swacked it. So got this thing trimmed up pretty good to walk side to side. If they can't see it, they're blind. I'm liking it, I'm liking the frog game. Let's keep it going. Oh, golly, Jer. Put the 45 on him. <laughs> I didn't even see that blow up. He, <laughs> he sucked it. it under. He had it. God, you gave him the business. I need a stick one. I don't know now. It's not, you're in that unsure phase. You're like, what am I doing wrong? Yeah, is I don't it know. me? Is it them? I think it's probably them. Jerry's hooked up. No! Oh, what? Chair. Got you braid on there? Yeah, I got like 65 pound braid. Is that the fourth one? Fourth one, dude. You're gonna have to put down your, your beer. Oh, come on, baby. Get out of there. Oh, that's a little better one. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh, put the put the nails in him. That was fun. I gave him the full Jerry hook set. Yeah. <laughs> that one could take it. Good one. Yeah, that one could take it. You're right. Some of them may not be big enough. Seems disappeared in that grass. <laughs> he just disappeared. He swam down. And he's gone. I didn't trim these tails. Extreme. Trim these. Shout out to Extreme. That thing is dialed for walking right now. Oh yeah, bud. Oh, you got him on the frog there, eh? This pocket's really good. To our right. It's not looking. It? It's not looking good. It has to be done. I can't just leave the. I'll leave the one of a kind pink frog. Well, guys, uh, just put the Crocs in four wheel drive. I got this pink frog. It's pretty special. I only have one of them. Got to go in and get it. So, graph saying three and a half feet right here. So we're, we're definitely past the nut level. Oh, this is gonna suck. Watch out for moccasins, please. Anything valuable in the pockets? Oh, suckage. Oh, this GoPro didn't go underwater. Oh my gosh. It's deep, bro. Oh God. I'm like in. <laughs> Hang on, I may have to get a little closer. It's gonna go past the GoPro if I jump in right there. All right, let's get a little bit closer. It's deep, I'm scared. Oh, I see, I see the, the 
the book now. It's, oh, here we go. Yes! Oh my gosh. There it is. Woo! I'm so glad I didn't have to get in. That'll work. Keep fishing. All right, little pinky. Little piggly wiggly coming back out. Into the padscapes we go. An evening dowser. Come on! There we go. Oh. Give him the muscle. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, he just spit up a bluegill. I just had a I just got blown up on. They're back there, Jer. That's a fat one. It's been eating good. Yeah. Let's see there it. There you go. Fast one all day. All right, boys. Old Pinky's working, working okay. Working okay. I'm having to wrench him out of this stuff. But it's sort of weird. The bites are not coming where you think they happen. They're, they're, that's where you think they would happen. Right there in these little pad gaps. They're kind of in the sparse stuff close to the bank casting past the pads we got some pretty open water back here jerry there you go jerry got one of the pads i wasn't even looking when he ate it that's when you hook him the best yeah i just heard the blow up looked back didn't see my frog then set the hook and i got one yeah, that one's skinny it's so crazy because the last one i caught was chunky and some of them are skinny don't know yeah that one i just caught spit up a bluegill we got a good pad stretch right here, so I think we're gonna keep old Pinky out, work this stuff, maybe throw a blazing worm on the outside edge. That's all. It's about all you can do in this thick grass lake. Super thick. This would be like Florida-esque, you know, shallow natural lake. It's a spring lake, and it's just full, full of grass. And it usually gets topped out in the fall, but it's dang near topped out right now in summer. So keep working this frog, see if we can get a tasty one. Oh. That first uh, couple seconds is pretty... Oh my gosh, dude. Oh! God, just ski those three pounders through there. Oh, look at the wake. Look at them waking, dude. They're waking in here. That thing just hit the water and got clapped. Woo! Had him double peg, guys. Woo! He wasn't getting off. He wasn't getting off. Now we're now we're getting a little better. Now we're getting a little better. Old Pinky. Doing some work. There was a few others that scattered off in there, but old muscle. Seven foot six inches of girth. Having to use all of it right here. Ooh. Some, there's definitely some activity in here in this little section. Oh, go ahead, come on. Oh, sorry, Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> Almost decapitated Jerry's neck there with the 40, 50 pound braid. That's right where he was, too. You got him! You got him! Oh my gosh, oh. that's a good one, Jerry. Woo! Oh I'm gonna follow up. Oh my god, this would be so epic. Come on. <laughs> I Come missed on. it. I missed it to the right. Dude, he won't. Oh my gosh, he hit yours. Oh my oh. gosh, dude. What? Oh. What? Oh, oh my gosh. gosh, that's a good one, too. Uh, <laughs> I don't even know if that's the same fish, dude. That could be a different one. <laughs> that was awesome. Let's go. If that's the same fish, hallelujah to that fish, man. It must be. It was in like the same spot. Yeah, territorial Let's grabber. See, yeah. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, that was a different fish, dude. You got him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Real, real, real. Get him in here. There we go. Doubled up. That one might be bigger, actually. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Nice double, dear. That's, uh, they're hunting in there. Yeah, yeah sure. they're active. That was, that was pretty sick. Yeah. That's three bites right there. Look, another one just pushed out. 
Yeah. Problem with this frog when I'm throwing back in there that far, like it takes a minute to come up sometimes, so I didn't know if he had it or not. But that's actually worked on the hook set. You gonna give him a second? Yeah. I can actually watch this one disappear. Yeah, you know. You know for sure. Thank you. Dude, I'm, yeah, I might want to just fling another one back there. Yeah. Oh my gosh, that one looked bigger. Let's see. There we go, there's a mid pad. Oh, give him the muscle. There's a better one, yeah, baby. Oh. That was awesome. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's eating little Piggly Wiggly. Ah. Whew. God, that is fun. Oh my gosh. Throw in there, yeah. It's a little premature. Got him. Yeah, Jerry. Get him out of that stuff. Oh, he took you way left. <laughs> Jerry's leaning on him. There you go. It's crazy what a oh two and a half pound fish can do in that grass. Oh my gosh. Nice that fish. might be That's more nice than two and a half. Though. Yeah, it might be. Nice catch. Oh, I got one on my... Waked it and took it under. This is nice. Oh, get him, Jared. Heard that. Oh. My oh. Gosh. Can I follow it up? Follow it up. It's like they went right back to that little spot. Oh my gosh! I saw my frog go down, but he didn't have it. I just like destroyed the frog on that hook. Oh my gosh! I missed him too, Jerry! <laughs> <laughs> You're right in there. You're gonna get him, bro. You're gonna get him. He was right there. He's completely missed my frog. Oh, get him! Yes! Get him, Jared! Wrench him! Wrench him, dude! Get him. Put him! Put the pen to him! I'm ripping out the pen. Are you bringing out the substrate? Oh, there he goes. He oh! He jumped and spit it. God, after all that. Through all that. Dude, that's that's rare. You get them through that junk and then they yeah, come out and, and spit he it. He jumps and spits a frog. Oh my god. Oh, well. <laughs> huge points for the uh, getting him pegged there. That was sick. That's the second time that happened where we. Yeah, Double triple. Teamed it. Triple yeah. Team of fish. Miss, miss, throw in, boom. Yeah. Oh my. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, he came off, dude. That was a better one, too. Shoot. Oh he just sucked it. Like he didn't explode on it. I don't, I don't think he had the full program. What is going on in that spot, dude? I know. We've gotten so many blow-ups in there. It's like eight blow-ups in that one little area. Put the full force of the uh, the drag system on there. Did not slip. I think there's around 15 pounds of drag on this one. The gold is like insane. I think it's 25, which is like what you use for tuna fishing. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Just give him the 
Give him the juice. Give him the juice and hope. Dude, that one just took it under and by the legs. That one did too. The third. Third strike. Got him. Oh. God, you think you got an eight pounder. It's just salad and two and a half threes. Absolutely love it though. Little butt spray. Smash the like button. Oh, he's behind it. He sees old Pinky. Pinky walking. Oh, I missed it, bro. God. I knew he missed it, and I still set the hook because I'm just so jacked right now. Come on, put old Pinky in your grill. Oh my God, he knocked it out of the water. He knocked Pinky out of the water. I got a little too excited. Pinky to the skies. Got him that time. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm pegged up. Oh, he came off. That was a double handed ranger. I could not get him. God. Oh man, I hate to say it, but it looked like a four pounder. I know, right? I know. I mean, I gave him everything I had. I gave him my heart. He took me down in the grass. Guys, I am physically worn out from the last few minutes of frog fishing. We were almost doubled up on frogs, getting the same fish, blowing up, casting after each other, and then trying to winch them out of that grass. We only got a couple of them, but we had like five of them hooked on and just, I ain't got me no love that sound. I love all of it. I love all the audio of frog fishing. It's so amazing. Whew. I'm going to try this little spot again. This is a, there's a little bare spot that's open or it doesn't have, it's not full of grass where Jerry is casting currently. Could get a little blow up. Could get a blow up and a glow up. A big part of the problem, you know, guys, when you're frog fishing, you gotta watch where your line is connected to the other pads. So you're, most of the time we're working our frogs with the rod tip down and it'll get into those pads like out here in front of me. And when you get a big one on and you're trying to wrench them, you're, get them, Jer. Jer's got an open lane. Get them up. There you go. Just ski him over like Jerry, and you're good to go. That a boy. But we be, you've got your line tangled up in stuff that's out in front of you, and you get a bite, and then you're having to work through all that extra stuff. Just even for a second, fish can get off. So it's very difficult. It's hard to do. It's happened to us a dozen times a day, but want to watch out for where your line is at all times. Oh yeah, you got a lean for him. Oh, that is so cool watching that frog disappear. So cool. Yes, sir. Woo. I think a couple more, Jerry, and we are, uh, we're about exhausted ourselves. Yeah. Arm's getting worn out. Oh my gosh. Oh, my, oh, my, oh. Dude, he had it. He was running with it. I missed him. Woo. Frog connections. It's about a 75% if you're lucky. You just missed one. Oh my gosh, dude. <laughs> 
<laughs> I mean, just the bites are awesome. Come back for it, baby. Come on. Oh, did you oh. see that, dude? Oh, that. Oh. Oh. oh, no, I got a big one, Jerry. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh shit, that's a big one. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, come here, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Dad gum, that fish hit it a couple times and threw back in there as soon as it hit the water. Oh my goodness. Woo! God, that was fun. That's why you frog fish right there, guys. Holy cow. Oh yeah. Get that out. Oh. Sucked it. Oh, you're beautiful. You're beautiful. I love you. I love you so much. I love you so much. I may have to end on you. Mm. Oh. Hang on. Jerry's doubled. We're doubled. Oh. We're doubled. Are we doubling it in it? We might. We might be. Heck We're doubled. Yeah, dude. Heck yeah. Oh my gosh. Seems like the frog bite's getting better. Hot day frogging. Oh, I just made a cast. I wasn't even thinking. Just muscle memory. Oh my gosh, bro. We can't leave. <laughs> we gotta leave, but we can't leave right now. This is too good. Oh my gosh, Jerry, you got him. Oh. oh man, the sound of a frog getting flushed is Oh my god. It's the best. I just had one right there, I had the tail. Ski him up. Just so fun. Eat me. This frog feels like sandpaper. Oh, you got another one, Jerry. Jerry's hooked up again. The sound of braid <laughs> wrenching, is... frog slurping. Oh, Come on, folks. Oh, I just made another cast. I, I didn't even need to. It's hard, dude. It's it's hard to get away from that. Oh. That's a good one. Oh, oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> oh, it's a good one to end on. Holy cow. Dude, that's a nice fish, too. All right, folks. We got deadlines to meet. We got to get back. But gosh, this has been awesome. Awesome day of frogging. Look at that chunk right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we just can't, we just can't be stopped. Huh? I mean, God. Boys, that was a frog fest. My gosh. Smash it, please. Stopping off the HQ real quick. I just heard about something in here that is uh, brand new, exclusive to the store. I'm gonna check it out. And here it is. HQ Green custom color you can only find right here. Look at this thing, this is wild. Wild. If you wanna get out there and get crazy green with them. There you go, HQ. Brand new in. Thought these weren't coming till the end of the month. No, they are here. They're here now. Okay, the two step is finally here. That's what we were throwing a little bit today, and uh, you guys have seen this in the video. That, that color right there, it's mm, one of my favorites. Two steps available as well. And you got to love a good old fashioned frog bite, guys. So I hope you enjoyed 
watching some fish smash some top water today. It's been a long time since I've been on, been on a good frog bite, so just had so much fun with it. Um, if you want to see a pink frog, let me know in the comments. That might be, might be something we could do. And if you guys want to pick up the new two steps, they are in the store as I showed you, but you can also get them online soon and use my promo code LFG save 10 at checkout. As always, thank you for tuning in to another outdoor adventure and I'll see you on the next one.